I want you to think for a moment of a few of the many great quotes on worry's worthlessness. Here's the first one. Worrying is like sitting in a rocking chair. It gives you something to do, but it doesn't get you anywhere. So true. Worrying expends so much energy and saps you from so much focus from your daily capacity. It's no wonder worry warts feel worn out all the time. How about this one? Worrying doesn't take away tomorrow's troubles, but it does take away today's peace. Ooh, true again. Worry troubles the pace of your heartbeat. It robs your brain from focus ability. It breaks your disposition and it leaves you with anxiety. Or this one. Worry is worshiping the problem. True three times. Because when you worry, you are giving the problem and attention, the adoration of your time, heart, and mind. So now hear from the one who is worthy of your worship. Jesus clearly states that worry does nothing. He says, don't worry about your life day to day. Can all that worry add a single moment to your life? My father cares for you. He will give you everything you need. Jesus invites you to welcome real energy and power back into your heart by placing your trust, your worship, back where it belongs. Jesus invites you to anchor your well-being in God's goodness and placing your entire life into his son. So turn your eyes upon Jesus, look full on his wonderful face, and the things of earth will grow strangely dim in the light of his wonderful grace. There's real power and transformation in following Jesus, being transformed by him and committing our lives to his mission. Let's pray. Lord Jesus, we give you great thanks that you have promised to provide for everything that we need. Forgive us for the times when we have wasted our energy and capacity on worry, which accomplishes nothing. Instead, help us to focus back on you. In you, we have life. In you, we have all that we need. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen.